Hey everybody, Duke here, Blue Tarp Hill. We got the, the new introduction to the mountain today. And let me show you who that is, Mr. Box Turtle. Found him down at the house. He was probably trying to get into a swimming pool with a bunch of chemicals and Hunter Bun and I decided let's bring him up here to that area. And on my way to deliver him to his new home, I found this. Oh, look at there. First black snake of the season. First snake I've actually seen probably in two years here. Decent sized snake, probably four feet or so. We're going to just avoid him. We're going to leave him up here. And uh, hopefully he does some good for us. So, never know what you're going to find at the mountain. <laughs> so, all right. So the turtle, um, we're going to set him out here. <laughs> that little snake just sitting out there in the middle just waiting. So, let's uh, get him out of there. I'm going to say hello to the camera. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're just going to set him down. And uh, I'm sure he is glad to get out of that box. And there he is. He's making his way down there. I'm pretty comfortable to say he will be much happier here than down at the... Uh, other house. Come on, you, you inches away from the water. I don't really know if he wants the water or, or not. Pond's up pretty high. Let's come all the way up here to the edge. You see little spots in there. And out in there where uh, it actually came to overflow. This will be a pond that I, that I deal with in the future. I come in and uh, it will lose the water. It will drop probably a good foot from where it's at right now. Uh, but we'll go ahead and get on that. And, nope, the snake is now gone. And he was heading toward the neighbor's property. <laughs> I prefer that. But... Uh, Back in the day, I'd have probably taken him out as long as he's away from the houses and stuff like that. I got no problem with him being up here as long as he's uh, black and uh, you know not one of the ones that uh, little rattlers on their tails. <clears throat> the turtle just kind of hanging out here. I don't know what he's doing. He's probably in shock to say, "Oh my gosh, I'm muddy. Look." Yeah, I'm in heaven. <laughs> uh, we decided to put him in this pond because we, we have found many turtles in this pond. Um, you know, there was, when the water's a little bit lower, you can, uh, you see them up on the logs and stuff like that. So the turtles definitely like being out in here. And already this year, I've seen where they've, uh, uh we had some really small turtles. They were probably at most an inch and a half, uh, I'll say in circumference. And um, they seem to uh, really like this pond. This is two years in a row that we've uh, uh, seen the, the babies come out of them. So uh, he's still hanging out there, just doing his thing. I will say, um, you know, there's also turtles that uh, hang out here. It's an old turtle shell. So that one didn't make it. But uh, regardless, just wanted to go ahead and, uh, you know, introduce you to the... BTH Life on the Mountain Wildlife
We're going to leave you alone. You want to say anything to uh, YouTube before we go? All right. Enjoy. Maybe I'll see him in a couple years. Other than that, today was the last haul block. So I'm going to work my way back over to the, uh, the stage site. And uh, of all that ready rock I've been hauling since October. And uh, get the last couple block off of there for the last time. Thank goodness. Oh my gosh almighty, I'm so tired of hauling rock. At any rate, we're good to go. Turtles in his home, snakes done moved away. Porch is looking great. It's a beautiful day on the mountain. Thanks for watching. God bless.